Oh, oh my god, I almost fall. Back pain here. <laughs> I've been disappeared for a while. Number one is I've been busy with life. I want to give you guys a little bit update before the video start. It's very simple. I'm sick. Right now, since I just got married, I don't really have my green card in America. So it's very hard for my health to be figured out since I cannot really buy myself insurance. So right now, I'm just trying to take over the counter medication and just uh, hope for the best. If you want to give me a prayer at night time, I'll be appreciated. But let's talk about the video. Me, back being, trying to defeat the hardest boss in Wild Heart, which is deeply volatile dead haste. The story is simple. It's just me trying to defeat this stupid poison bird. However, why is it so hard? And boy, did it go well. No, it actually not. But why that haze is so hard for me? At the beginning, I thought everything would be simple. I just need to go in, do some parry, and hit it just like a normal bird. But boy, did Backbeam go entirely wrong. Deeply volatile dead haze has so many skills. And whenever I try to output my damage, you already guess what happened. Each time, I can't not guess what he's gonna do next, which leads to one thing. Dead haze, more like dead. For the training of dead haze, I have die, 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 and guess what? Die a couple more times, and yeah, I die some more. In order for me to start getting the parry in, now that is just the parry. Me, back being, has feel like I have failed. To you, my audience, my friends, my hunter, but also to myself. I only stopped playing Wild Heart for two weeks and this is what happened. My parry was off. I don't even know what to do. I cannot even guess what that haze is gonna do next. This, this is probably it. Countless encounter with that haze so that I just be able to learn one simple thing is impossible. Deeply volatile dead haze not only is just so strong but also he has a lot of HP or she I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I step outside it was a rainy day and I was just thinking would this be the kimono that makes me stop playing wild hearts forever and maybe I will play Final Fantasy 16 now I'm just kidding. After a deep breath, some fresh air, I can do this. I will not fail you guys. And I wanted to show you how can I defeat this stupid motherfucking bird. <clears throat> Let's get into the real training. I parry this, I parry that. I start to learn the pattern a little bit more clearer. And guess what? I actually managed to defeat him once. I wanted to actually defeat the deeply volatile kimono quest. What did I gain? What did I learn from it? I started to learn the pattern. This bird has no pattern. I mean, it actually does, but and what works for me might not work for you. As a plated well, that's a name. A lot of people told me I need to learn how to parry, but I'm very bad at the game. So, I play patiently. I learn exactly what I can parry and what I cannot. When the bird slammed down and there's a stone on the ground, you know what? You should dodge that. Not only just dodge, you just you just run for your life.
I guess I can say this is a proud feeling of you knowing that you accomplished something important. Obstacle is something it's just in your mind. You could fail one time, you could fail 10 times, and you could fail a hundred times. But what matters the most is that when you step outside, have some fresh air, you come back in, and you never give up. You fight and fight for the life of you. Just to know this impossible task, this impossible quest, is not impossible no more. And with the back bay has been back. I whisper to their taste. Let me back you. So yeah, I know you guys, a lot of you guys have been asking me to play with you. And uh, the only thing I could say is that I have been struggling with my health. But sometimes I just feel bad because I know you guys are waiting and you guys are enjoying watching my video. So I don't want to fail you. And I was thinking, why not sharing something that I enjoy doing? Especially just learning how to beat one deeply volatile kimono like this. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. And what can I say? You guys are the best. Stay awesome. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.